Good morning everyone, good evening, my name is Calvin Kempel and I am full of energy and super excited right now because today I'm going to talk about how I was able to travel to six different countries in just four months. I had a lot of people asking me on Instagram, through Facebook, how I was able to travel to all these different locations from the country of Jordan to Europe to just so many different beautiful places and so I figured why don't I just make a video about it, um, kind of explaining what I did so that hopefully you can learn from that and maybe able to even implement some of the things that I did to help you travel. I did a lot of videography on the side so that's where I kind of took the approach to kind of use my skills to work with companies. So it all kind of started back in March where I was like, I kind of want to just travel the world. I see all these other Instagrammers, all these other people doing it. Why don't I try to do it? I actually, I bought a one-way ticket to go to Honolulu, Hawaii. Um, I didn't know where I was going to go after that, what I was going to do, but I just was like, you know what, I'm going to go for it. I'm going to take that risk and I'm very happy I did. Like I said, it started in Hawaii. I took that plane ticket, that flight, landed in Hawaii. From there, I worked with a couple tour and activity companies. I worked with Dolphins and You, which is just an amazing company that's actually on the west shore of Hawaii, and they take you out to see dolphins and you go swimming with them. So also while I was there, I worked with a hotel, film for them a little bit, and then also an amazing zipline tour called Climeworks, super awesome. Um, first time ever going down a zipline, and it was, you know, over the North Shore of Hawaii. Just absolutely super cool. A lot of you may be wondering, you know, how I got these deals. A lot of it was just through cold emails and cold calls. Very nerve-wracking at first, you know. Like I said, you have to take risks. You have to go out of your comfort zone um, if you want to succeed. I'm not a big phone talker, and I was just, you know, calling up and, hey, <laughs> this is what I do. <laughs> do you want this video? And a lot of it is back and forth, and eventually it worked out. Also on Oahu, I was able to go meet up with a bunch of other Instagrammers. We got to do some really cool stuff like Stairway to Heaven. So right now, we're on the way to right now. Stairway, Stairway to Heaven. heaven. Of course, I had a very small budget when I was on Hawaii. Um, didn't have too much money, so I was trying to conserve and just be the best steward of it. A big thing that actually helped me save money while I was there, that was totally unexpected, was meeting some amazing people. There was uh, local Hawaiians, so just some other Instagrammers, that were just super friendly and so nice and just offered to let me stay at their place. One of them um, being Luke. Some call it an animal. <laughs> some call it a royal Hawaiian. Uh, yeah, we yeah, just yeah. call it Luke. <laughs> yeah, all mad for my monkey style. <laughs> <laughs> the coolest like, man in like Hawaii. This, man. <laughs> he invited us to stay at his place and was over there for a week and a half. So that really helped save money and it was just super blessing. Thank you, Luke, if you're watching this. This guy knew some really cool trails and secret spots on Hawaii. <laughs> Luke was also super kind to give us some rides around the island. 
We didn't rent a car while we were there, so doing a lot of hitchhiking, you can always find someone who's willing to hitchhike you in Hawaii. Gotta love that Hawaiian spirit. Another awesome person that we met, Lisa. Uh, super cool girl, pretty rad. Uh, she goes free diving a lot. She actually has her own jewelry business. So I really suggest if you want some authentic Hawaiian jewelry, be sure to check out her stuff. It's super awesome. Lisa also took us some cool spots. Uh, we actually went free diving with her, which is pretty cool. I've never really done that before, but I was able to like hold the rock at the bottom of the ocean and just like walk. And it was really difficult at first. You know, you see all these videos and it looks easy. It actually takes uh, some skill and getting used to it. So while on Oahu, I got my first doors off helicopter experience. Super, super cool. It was just absolutely incredible. I was able to get a deal with Paradise Helicopters. We were able to create a video for them in exchange of going around the island. And it was just beautiful to see these just gigantic, massive mountains and waterfalls and seeing the coastline and things that you normally don't get to see um, if you're just if you're not in a helicopter. <laughs> the shrimp on the North Shore is to die for. It's it's so good. I would literally just go back to Oahu to eat the shrimp on the North Shore. It's just absolutely amazing. The thing is, when traveling, you have to take risks. You have to go out of your comfort zone. I was willing to just camp out and you know sleep in a car or sleep on the beach. Thankfully, I actually never was was in that situation because of the awesome people I met. With that being said, I'm gonna stop that video today of this episode one of how I was able to travel to six different countries in just four months. I'm gonna talk a little bit how I was able to stay on the big island next, and then after that, Jordan, and then Europe, Thailand, Bali, so on. Thank you so much for watching the video. Hope you enjoyed it. Be sure to subscribe, give the video a like, comment below. So if you have any ideas or suggestions, on future videos I should make, just comment them below. I'll be sure to read your comments, I'm super excited. This is one of my first videos where I have this type of talking head style, um, but I'm gonna have a lot more in the future. So again, thank you for watching, episode one.